si tsho poem pe ku rena rona uh as you saw the title of the video I'm going to show you the best u s d t trading strategy pure price action okay so without any further waste of time guys I'm going to jump straight to it so the first step that you need to do is to determine the trend okay determine the trend as you can see with this example next to uh, the writing is showing an uptrend your lower low lower high higher low higher high higher low higher high higher low and higher high so this shows that the market is on a bullish momentum okay on a higher time frame that's the first thing that you do you go on a higher time frame you check for a trend whether a trend is up trending or down trending okay and then the second thing is we look for a breakout okay second thing look for a break out doesn't matter if it breaks out in a bullish or bearish but for this example say the market actually breaks out like this this is what you look for I, is what you look for and then right after the market breaks out on a higher time frame say for instance h4 time frame or one hour or daily okay you check for the trend but i would recommend the four hour in the daily say for instance usdt just broke out of the market like this okay and we have a level right here it's going for a retest okay sometimes the market won't move straight like this so for you to execute those trades towards this level right there that will be your take profit the 90 percent rule okay i won't be explaining that on this video but if you want to learn the 90 percent rule just check out this video up here somewhere i don't know where it is but yeah just check it out so yeah you wait for the market to break out right after the market broke out doesn't matter if you find the market in the middle of a trend maybe probably around here doesn't matter where you fall. doesn't matter where you find the market as long as you see you saw or you see that the market is currently on a bearish uh, movement from an uptrend okay the market broke out and you notice that the market is now on a bearish momentum that's where we're going to look for our corrections to execute trades something like this okay something like this we're going to look for correction impulse correction impulse to our take profit okay so right after the market breaks up that's what you do you look for corrections on a lower time frame and you ride the trend you ride the trend to the downside okay i'll be showing you a real-time chart examples just stick with me right here so guys yes that's the first thing that you do Okay, that's the first thing that you do you wait for the market you determine the trend and then the second thing you do you wait for the market to break out okay wait for a breakout wait for a breakout second thing look for corrections bearish corrections like i mean uh, bearish patterns 
if you are on a downtrend and if you are on an uptrend we look for bullish patterns okay like your flag bullish flag bearish flag and all those patterns i won't be going into details into this video but these are the steps that you do okay determine the trend wait for a breakout look for corrections toward the downside if the trade is like this uh, in a real time chart okay then the fourth thing you do repeat repeat all these steps over and over and over again okay reason why i'm saying this is best when you're steady or actually guys it's best anywhere on currencies nasa red gold reason why i'm saying US state is because US state moves quicker and faster and it's volatile it is a lot of money okay so if you want a lot of money you know where to go you go to US state so guys let's go to the real time chart example as you can see we have something like the drawing that i had right there okay let me just remove everything as we can all see that on a four hour time frame we are bullish the market is currently bullish okay so we're going to go and like drag our trend of course we all know that we have things like trend within a trend and stuff like that and all those things there are a lot but just to keep the chart clean you don't have to actually draw all the trends that you see okay but for the purpose of this video i'm just going to go ahead and just for a visualization you see that we own an uptrend okay we own an uptrend then we also have a trend within a trend okay we have this of something like this okay when we jump on a lower time frame we will notice that we also have a trend on a lower time frame okay so you you analyze from a high time frame then you jump down to the lower time frame that will actually improve your win rate okay and it, it will improve uh, the probability of your trades going to profit or your win rate or however you want to call it so jumping to the four hour time frame uh, it becomes much clearer okay it becomes much clearer that we do we do have a, a trend within a trend remember we are in a bullish momentum but on a lower time frame we could have some opportunities during these moments of a bullish doesn't mean that we can't take sales on a lower time frame if we see opportunities but we have to be careful of course we have to follow the trend so we also have a trend right here of which it got broken okay this trend got broken let's go to the one hour on the one hour this is where it's going down okay this is where it's going down as we can see that USDT broke out of this trend okay USDT broke out of this trend and continuously gave us impulse correction impulse correction impulse and correction all the way down and it's still going to give us the same patterns until it reaches probably maybe this level right here until it reaches this target okay if you have some basic knowledge on the market you can already see that we do have a correction here of which is not clear on a higher time frame but it is going to be clear on a lower time frame so we have a series of impulse and correction impulse and correction okay let me go to the 30 jumping down to the 30 you see okay we all see impulse correction impulse correction and we also had a very big correction right here okay we also had a big correction right there I impulse correction impulse correction 
imperfection here and other correction there these these other corrections are much clearer on the law so we have to like jump to a lot of time frame to see these corrections as you can see in post correction all the way down it's as easy as that just like this nothing more nothing less this is my trading strategy and i recommend that you practice this then you use it until you profit from it because it's simple it's easier makes things easy not complicated so that's me for this video guys peace